Phillies hosting the Blue Jays, and the Blue Jays are plus 130 on the money line. The Phillies are minus 154. The over-under, 8.5 runs. The Blue Jays getting a run and a half on the run line are minus 166, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. And the Phillies laying a run and a half on the run line are plus 138, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win by two or more. And the Phillies crushed the Blue Jays today, 10-1. to 1. Berrios did not have a very good outing. It's probably his first one in a, in a while. Bassett did not pitch against the Phillies last year or this year. Nola pitched once against the Blue Jays, five innings, four runs, four earned. They won that game nine to four, and he struck out uh, seven batters. The weather for tomorrow's game is supposed to be 79 degrees, 14% chance of rain, and 11 mile per hour winds blowing out. Now, before you bet the over unders, use a site like RotoWire. It will tell you in there, in the lineups, which direction the wind is blowing in. So this way, you know, you get an accurate assessment for the over-unders. Head-to-head, -head, these teams are 5-5 five and five against each other. The, home, the Phillies are on a two-game winning streak. The home team is 8-2. and two. The favorite is 8-2 and two on the money line. The favorite or the underdog getting or laying runs is 5-5. Five and five. There have been four one-run games in their last 10. The over is hit in their last two. The over is 6-4, and four, and the over 8.5 runs is 6-4. and four. The Blue Jays are 2-3 and three as a team in Bassett's last five starts. He's got an ERA of 2.8, averaging five and a third innings pitched. They've lost his last three starts, and the under is 3-2 and two in his last five starts. He's averaging five and a third innings pitched, 5.6 hits, 3.2 runs, 2.8 of which are earned, five strikeouts, 2.6 walks, and 94.8 pitches. That's a law of averages. That's his last five starts averaged out. For Nola, they're 5-0 and in his last five starts. He's got an ERA of 2, averaging 6 and 2 thirds innings pitched. They've won his last five starts, and the over-under is 2-2-1. Two, two, and 6.2, uh, 6 and 2 thirds innings pitched, 4.4 hits, 2 earned runs, 6.6 .6 strikeouts, 2 walks a game, 1 home run a game. He didn't give up a home run in his last start, but the other 4 he did. And then 95.6 pitches. The Blue Jays are 3-7 and seven in their last 10 one and three in their last four. It's even worse than that. One and five in their last six. 12 runs, nine runs, 19 runs, and then 11 runs. Three runs and a loss, six runs and a win, eight runs and a loss, one run and a loss. The Phillies are hot. They're nine and one in their last 10. They are on a seven game winning streak. 17 runs, nine runs, seven runs, 11 runs. 14 runs and a win, five runs and a win, six runs and a win, 10 runs and a win. They got off to a slow start and now they're starting to roll as expected. Phillies with the money line. Phillies laying the runs. I'm going to lean... I'll lean under in this one. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.